from today up to Friday and the next week this revival's miracles will take place diseases will be people will be healed in this place every captive will be set free in this place in the name of Jesus Holy Spirit of God we urge you start with us and move with us we need you to call us through we need you to call us through we need you to call out through. We need you to call out through. Yes, In the name of Jesus, we refuse to be normal. Yes. We refuse to stay in a one position. Yes. But we need you, Holy Spirit, yes. to raise us to another level. Yes. To raise us into another glory. Yes. To raise us into another state. Yes. To raise us into another land. Yes. In the name of Jesus, Ribosha. Your Nago tire odona omwe wana kore ma Holy Spirit of God. Holy Spirit of God. Speak in this meeting now. Speak in this meeting now. In Jesus' name. Amen. Amen. Father, we thank you because you're with us. We thank you for what you're doing now. And what you're going to do tomorrow. And what you're going to do on Friday. We lay everything in your hands. Speak unto us in Jesus' name, Amen. Can we appreciate Jesus? 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 Hallelujah! 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 Amen. I want to assure you before Friday comes, I will be coming with some people here, and even that guy is very good in playing the bass guitar. I believe he will come and. Na tukitoka kwa hii church tutaomba Mungu atupatie drum set kwa sababu I, I, I do music with drum set so I'm, I'm trying to change myself na feel kuna na mahali si move bana asifiwe so I believe by, by 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 before we do this meeting God will provide and will command money to buy a drum set in this church wale watu wapendi kupeana wameanza kujazwa na baridi lakini tutapata in Jesus name hallelujah niko na uwezekano you can have a seat in a few minutes and I believe I'll just do introduction of my message. Then we are going to continue from tomorrow henceforth in Jesus' name. Hallelujah. Bible says now you know how I do. You know how I do my things. I do as I sing. I preach as I sing because I love music. So okay, it's a background. I love it. Now, I we sana left kuhusu Uhusu, uhusu hope na nikaanza kusema leo amehubiri yote ile nilikuwa nataka kuhubiri tahubiri nini but the spirit of god <laughs> ameanza kuongea maana asifiwe and, and i love that uh, our message in this in this time that leverage gave me uh, and if i call you leverage don't mind i love you so much so 
I feel to call you that way and I thank God for you. My message, my message is I'm talking about there is still hope. In the book of in the book of in the book of Ezra chapter 10 from verse 3 the Bible talks about about what happened uh, the children of Israel the Bible says they did what was evil in the eyes of God by inter, by intermarrying and marrying the, the foreigners God is calling them foreigners of that land and God has commanded them not to marry now uh, ninapenda kuhubiri na kizungu lakini kwa hiyo mkutano nasikia ni changanye Kiswahili na Kikuyu mtanikubalisha bana asifiwe vile nitazangalisha nikubalisheni bana asifiwe napenda sana kuongea hiyo kizungu lakini na feeling vizuri zikichanganya kwamba mtu kila mtu anafikiwa biblia inasema kwamba hawa watu wana wa Israeli walienda na wakaambiwa mnapokaa mahali pale msioe wanawake pale na mabibi wa pale lakini wakafanya makosa moja wakaoana pale na walipooana pale kulikuwa na regulation na repercussion za hayo matendo bana asifiwe yakoba wangeoana pale repercussion ilikuwa labda kifo ama Mungu aachilie upanga juu yao ama aachilie famine ama aachilie falme fulani awamalize bana asifiwe na ikakuwa ya kwamba wamejua ya kwamba walikatazwa na wamejipata bibi inasema yakoba wakaitana wakaambiana yakoba tumefanya makosa na watu wetu paka makuhani wetu wamefanya makosa wameoa ma bibi wamewawa wastana mahali hapa kwa hivyo ikakuwa ni shida katika katika ule muji lakini i thank god for the men of god like Ezra hallelujah that's why we love men of god in the city that's why we love people who listen to the voice of god because even though other people had done what was evil in the eyes of god there was a man of god his name is Ezra the report wa iletwa mbele yake akaisikiza akasikia vile kumefanyika bibi sema akalalua ralua mavazi yake akaiweka chini akaanza kumulilia Mungu akasema makuhani na kila mmoja wa ile muji wa ume wote na viongozi waitwe waletwe mbele zake akawaambia umefanya makosa na hii makosa tunahitaji tufukuze wala wanawake ili ghadhabu ya Mungu isianguke juu yetu wote wakajawa na uoga wakakubaliana wafanye vile lakini Biblia inasema ya kwamba the spirit of the Lord came upon Ezra na Ezra akatabiri kitu kingine tofauti alikuwa amewatabiria mara ya kwanza ya kwamba kulingana na makosa yenu mtaisha Mungu atawapeana kwa mkubwa wa Babiloni lakini akasema atakana kwamba atakana kwamba umefanya makosa there is your hope ah akasema atakana kwamba mlikuwa umehukumiwa kifo there is your hope atakama mlikuwa umehukumiwa kumalizwa akawaambia another report yeah is your hope hey ha ha yeah i hear hallelujah listen listen when i was leading this sermon god gave me a a a a a liberation that each and every time we are living we find ourselves falling in a certain tunaanguka kwa makosa fulani kwa sababu ya hali fulani zinatusukuma na wale watu wametusumbuka wanakosa kuelewa wale tunatembea na wao wanakosa kutuelewa wazazi wako wanakosa kukuelewa ndugu zako wanakosa kukuelewa dada zako wanakosa kukuelewa wazee wa kanisa wanakataa kukuelewa watu wa kijiji wanakataa kukuelewa na wote wanachukua hukumu juu yako wote wanachukua hukumu juu yako lakini hata kana kwamba wote wamechukua hukumu juu yako ona Mungu mmoja aliye mbinguni ambaye huwa na badrisa statement wakati ilikuwa imetembekana ya kwamba imefika wa kumalizwa akaongea tena na Ezra akamwambia waambie there is your hope 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 as i'm gonna say yes there is your hope hallelujah sometimes the constant press us so much and you nobody can understand you i'm feeling to preach to somebody wakati nilikuwa nafanya kazi ya punda nikijaribu kuongea na watu hawangeona kitu ndani yangu 
hawangeona mtu anaenda mahali kwa sababu waliniweka in that level walihukumu hiyo siku ah ninasema walihukumu hiyo siku ninaongea na wewe mama ambao bwanako amekufukuza ninaongea na wewe mzee ambao mke wako ameondoka ninaongea na wewe kijana biashara yako imefungwa ninaongea na wewe msana siku ya harusi uliachwa ninaongea na wewe mama ambayo watu wenu wamesema you are good for nothing hata kana kwamba kila mtu anaweza kuacha una Mungu aliye pinguni una Mungu aliye pinguni ambao hafanyi vitu kama wanadamu anasema hata kana kwamba watu wote wamekuacha watu wote wamekuacha ukikuja kwangu na uache dhambi zako na utubu dhambi zako nitazisahau nitazionoa kwa nini Yes you hope. Ah, there is your hope. Sometimes back kwa kanisa watu wanakupiga kwa sababu uliongea ulimi ikatereza waka wanakuwa wanakuchanyika wanakupiga wanaamua kukumaliza hata ukufukuza kwa kanisa usijali na wao hao ni wanadamu hao ni wanadamu una jehova anaona moyo wako una jehova anasikia moyo wako anasema yes you hope bado kuna tumaini raba shakala last year i went through fire last year but one i went through fire nikapigwa kila kona ninapigwa kila mahali nikienda kila mahali watu wananiongea nikiingia kwa nyumba ninaulizwa maswali mtoto wangu hata kukataa chule ule mwingine kwa kanisa ananiacha nikafika mahali nikashindwa nigeuke kwa nani niende kwa nani lakini Jehova akanisungumzia akaniambia even though wewe uko chini bado unaweza inuka tena because you have hope in me i have come to tell you there is Jesus in heaven even when we are nothing he gave us hope even the day we are nothing he gave us hope i want to speak to you don't die don't stay there and die don't stay there and die yes you hope i'm doing an introduction ezra say give another report the first report was mutaumbia mutaisha kwa sababu mmekosea lakini akasema hata kana kwamba kumetangazwa kuisha there is your hope ah there is your hope why ule mungu hupeana tumaini hajakufa hajaondoka na hali hajaondoka na mambo hajaondoka na tumaini hajaondoka ye yeah, bado anaishi amekaa kwenye kiti cha enzi anasema hey, there is you hope bado kuna tegemeo oh hallelujah the bible says just live by faith just live by faith listen hope catalyzes faith and when there is no faith there is no hope they walk hard by hard if we read the scripture the bible says he had hope in hope and when you continue you say he never grow weak in faith why hope go hard to hard with faith and jesus said even though you have a small faith like a mustard seed you can command a mountain to go and go let me tell you something this other evening even though you have nothing left even though everything is not there there you have to still have faith in god and because you have faith in god there is still hope for you to rise again there is still hope for you to rise again there is still hope for you to rise again and someone lift up your head and say yes there is still hope for me I, i'm feeling i don't know what to do i have a lot of points here but but i don't know what god is doing i don't know what god is i have a lot of points praise the name of the lord but listen to me there is a day nilika kwa kwa nyumba let me give a testimony today as we preach and kesho tutaendelea points kuna wakati nilika kwa nyumba yangu nikauliza mama 
tumeokoka sisi akaniambia ndio nikamuuliza na kama tumeokoka Mungu wako wapi mpaka tunakosa chakula tunakosa chakula ya kupea mtoto wacha sisi ya mtoto akaniangalia akaniambia umeuliza swali ngumu nikasimama hapo nje nikaambia Mungu kama we Mungu ndio unaishivyo ninataka saa hii utume mtu aniletee pesa ya mtoto asilale njaa kulikuwa kumenyesha nimekaa hapo nje hivi naangalia nje naongea na Mungu because yes yo so, nikuwa nimekaa pale mtu akakuja na Mercedes I want to show you how God works mtu akakuja na Mercedes akakuwa makwangu nje kaingia kwa matope kwangu nje pa akaanza kukanyanga mafuta haiendi haiendi mimi nilikuwa na mafurota I had the spirit speaking to me. Enda ukamsaidie, nimekupea nguvu ya kumkwamua. I don't know what is. Sijui naongea na nani. Nimekupea nguvu ya kumkwamua. Nikaenda na mafurota zangu na kinyasa ya jinsi wakati huo kimeraruka ni ile jinsi imeisha wakata kwa sababu hauna nguo zingine za kuvaa kwa hivyo ukitupa hauna nguo ya kazi Aha. praise the name of the lord that because there is your hope mimi ndio navaa suti kama hii my friend as long as you are in god something good is going to happen to you nikana nikamwambia how are you sir akaniangalia hivi akaniza haya are you speaking english kambia yes kambia how can i help you I said man I've just felt that I need to assist you because you are stuck. And I'm like what are you talking about? Me yes sir. What am I, what am I, should I supposed to do? I'm like you just sit from your seat and go to the next seat. Mercedes. And the man looked at me and think Mercedes mtu akinyadha na frota. I Mercedes mtu akinyadha na frota. Not only that, he looked a young boy because I was I was I think that time I was about 27 years or 26. So I was I was a little bit younger. So akaniangalia, akakosa mtu asaikalia Mercedes. And telling you the truth, si kwai ni shaikalia Mercedes zingine. But nilikuwa nimezoea kuendesha tukarimu zetu. Tuendesha tukarimu zetu wenyewe. Nilikuwa nimezoea kutotoa kwa matope. niangalia akasikiza ndani yake aliposikiza nikaambia Mungu Mungu umeniambia umenipea nguvu ya kuondoa asonge huko ye yeah, ananifikiria ana, ana, vile nitakalia kwa gari yake na mimi naufikiria vile atasongeshwa na Mungu nataka kuzungumzia kama uko unategemewa kwa Mungu kuna watu watasongeshwa Aha, kama uko unategemewa kwa Mungu no matter the your level as long as uko na tumaini watasongeshwa wakupatie mahali aha Praise the name of the Lord. Amen. Skiza, I'm giving a testimony today. I will give you point tomorrow. Akasonga pole pole. Alipokaa kiti ya pande ile kwa maana hangeshuka gari kwa matope. Akaniangalia, nikiingia akaniuliza, "Are you sure?" Nikamwambia, "Very." Sasa naongea kizungu yote. Sema amen. Siko nimezoea kuongea kizungu kwa shule. Nataka kama naendesha punda na na pia ni kwa kanisa. Kanisa ni mzuri. Sio hope kwa kanisani. Nikaongea akasonga. Nikaingia, nikamuliza gear namba 1 iko wapi? <laughs> Akaniangalia akashindwa. Huyu mtu anauliza gear ataiendesha apeleke wapi? Akaniuliza I asked you, are you sure? Nikamuliza gear namba 1 iko wapi? Kwa nini? It's not about my ability about God who's in me. Akaniambia inawekewa hapa nikamuliza namba 2 inawekwa hapa. Mercedes iko tofauti. Haiendeshi kama hizi gari za kawaida. Gear zake ziko huku. Hizi <laughs> zingine zikiwa huku, hii iko huku, ziko opposite. Na kuna kitu kanavutwa hapo juu inasukumwa. Kanionyesha akiwa hapo. Nikakalia vizuri nikaweka hiyo namba moja. Nikaifinya mafuta ikiwa kwa matope. Sasa hiyo amefunga vio. Ikiwa hapo nikaweka namba 2. Brr akasema eh hey! akaona gari yake huko kabla aliambia sifai ku change nilikuwa nimechange na imeruka na imetoka kwa matope nikaipeleka nikaisimamisha mahali hakuna matope nikamwambia i told you sir i'm well able he said thank you so much akarudi kwa mfuko akanipea 1500 na 500 listen to me my friend 
listen to me my friend as long as you are in God as long as you are in Christ there is your hope you can't die even the last minute God will save you I say even the last minute God will save you even the last minute God will save you as long as you have hope in him and I went back to my house and I told my wife I'm a rich man a rich man 1,500 a lot of money at that time nilikuwa nafanya kazi wiki mzima ama mbili mwezi ndio nifike dhao sasa niambie umepata 1500 in 20 minutes very rich nikamwambia sasa nataka totoka tena kwa duka akaniambia siku change kinyaza nikamwambia hapana i'm feeling to bounce <laughs> na frota na matope tukaenda nikanunua tukafanya shopping tukarudi kwa nyumba and that day that the first day i knew god respond to prayers instant where there is hope you know the problem you are, you are you know the problem you are facing today what you ngena kikundi okay so hiki ko yone getha wigwe no then ona na kuri omothi to do etike ya gai makora ihu aina shida number 2 hiyo ni kwanza na kikuyu number 2 nirudia na kiswahili nirudia na kiswahili unajua shida ulio nayo ni kwa sababu una miningi mungu ambani Mungu ambaye anahitaji mabroka na watu wengine ndio afike. Ah ah, I'm speaking to you. You don't need all that. Kile unahitaji ni tumaini ndani ya Bwana. Akuje saa hiyo. Ah. Kile unahitaji ni tumaini. Mungu akuje saa hiyo. Sawa kaambia aje. Praise the name of the Lord. Bana asifiwe. The problem we are serving Christian and you are serving you people of God. Kwa maana tunaaminingi Mungu wa mambali. Ukiomba Mungu unaobanga Mungu wa mbali. Listen, tumaini sio vitu ziko mbali. The Bible says faith is the substance. Umesema hope for. And the, in, in, in the Hebrews chapter 1, the Bible says now faith is now, not tomorrow. And that faith is the substance of things hoped for so there are things they are supposed to act in faith i'm giving i'm giving you a, a, my testimony because there is still hope for you another day nikatoka nikaambia mungu nitoka kanisani nikapita mahali nimebeba mtoto wangu niliwacha nimepeana 10000 kwa kanisa mtu wa punda amekusanya 10000 kitu kwa harambe wacha wewe mpaka 1000 ukipeana naenda kuandika kwa kareda wachana na hiyo tabia i give 10000 nikakuja nayo nikapeana watu wakalia mtu wa punda amepeana 10000 wakalia kanisa hawakulia juu ya 10000 walilia kwa sababu amepeana amebaki na nini na ametoa wapi mtu wa punda amepeana 10000 kwanza ametoa wapi number 2 amebaki na nini Number three, who lazima kuwa ni mjinga. Makaanza kulia. But I, and I hope in God. I had hope in God. Nikapeana. Tuko tumespiga pin. Nikapeana. Everybody cried. Watu wakalia. Na situ kalia. Sia tujua nalia kwa nina. Situ kalia. Kalia sana hata sisi. Kwa mana emotion zili tupeleka. But situ litoa tukua natakemeo kwa mungu. That's the day nilipita. Mahali kulikuwa na ba. Nikakasirika. Nikaona nimebeba mtoto wangu hivi na jua hatuna kitu ya kukula isipokuwa kamchera tumepewa kwa kanisa nimemwekelea hapa kwa mabega nimeshika miguu akikuwa anaitanga degegei kama naye hapa na mavitu mingi unajua mtoto akua mdogo anabanga vitu mingi mavitu mingi na amevaa vitu zingine hajui kutembea nazo wakati huo so anaenda akihanguka tunaenda tu tukaenda tukafika tukapita hapo kwa baa nikaiangalia that the time i experience faith I spoke faith. Kabia mungu. Nyanganya mtu moja gari hapa unipe. Siwezi kuwa na kufanyia kazi na ninatembea mugu. Kwa nalipo onge hiyo kitu kutoka hiyo siku. The first month mwezi moja kuenda kuisha. Nikanunua pick up. Kwenye pesa ilitoka sijui. I'm speaking to you. There is your hope. As long as you are in God. There is your hope. You can do something. Something can happen in your life. Hey! Kulikuwa na harusi nikuwe na pango kwa kandisa wakati huo. And I told that brother. Siku ya harusi yako, nita kubeba na gari. Na nikiongea hivyo, sijui, sijui, pesa nitoka hapi, na gari kwa hapi. 
wakanichekelea wakaniambia gari na mnongo na mtu ameshiba kwanza kula ushibe kwanza nikamwambia nyinyi ndio mko na jaa sio mimi speak faith speak hope nikanunua nikabeba mates kwa hiyo pick up nyuma hata kama hiyo gari ilikuwa mzee kuniliko wakati wa registration niliwabeba nyuma mates kamsaidia nikafikiza kwa church ambia nilikwambia atakubebea mates na gari yangu eh akaniza ni yako nikamwambia eh akasema hakuna nikamwambia ndio hiyo ni yangu wakaanza kusema hapana wanajua mwenyewe nikamwambia ni jueni mwenyewe lakini ni mimi ndio mwenyewe and from that day from that day maisha ya punda ikaondolewa maisha ya magari ikaanza kufro i'm speaking to somebody i'm giving a testimony ikaanza kufro tuka tukanua kiwanja ya kanisa bora napeana hii Mungu anajua tukapeana pesa tukanua kiwanja ya kanisa Mungu akanipea proti ya kwanza tukanua kiwanja ya kanisa Mungu akanipea proti ya kwanza tukajenga kanisa ya mabati ingine iko na mgongo na ni pana ni konda yani iko tu funny funny <laughs> eh iko funny funny tukajenga si mimi tukajenga nyumba ya room ya mawe room mbili ya mawe hivi laini na kitchen ya mbao hapo kando hiyo sifa ilitanda kijiji mzima mtu wa punda amejenga nyumba kubwa ya mawe na umejenga room mbili ninatangaza kabla tumalize hizi mkutano Mungu akufanyie kitu watu wenyu wote waongee watu wenyu wote waongee kile Mungu amekufanyia asamone says there is your hope there is your hope nikaendelea tukaendelea tukajenga 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 tukamaliza i'm giving a testimony kanisa ikamaliza kujengwa nilipomaliza kujengwa tukaambiana tutajenga kanisa ingine mzuri tubomoe hiyo tukajenga kanisa kama hii tulipojenga kanisa kama hii Mungu akanipea pesa nikanunua kanyumba sasa si kanyumba karaini nikanunua kanyumba kengine kakona shape kidogo kwa sababu there is your hope i'm giving a testimony tukajenga kama hii kabla tukihama kutoka kwa hiyo tuingie hii na sisi tukahama kutoka kwa hiyo kanyumba tukaingia nyingine ninaongea na mtu ambao tegemeo yake kwa Mungu lazima kuna vitu zinafuata na zinafanyika nataka kuinua imani yako uone mtu wa punda akinunua nyumba <laughs> uone mtu wa punda akiwa mhubiri uone mtu wa punda akiongea kizungu nataka uone mtu wa punda akivaa suti nataka uone mtu wa punda akiongea kwa mataifa i want to speak to your life kuna tumaini hata kana kwamba hakuna kitu kinaonekana hapa kuko akasema even though even though it tarries it will come to pass why there is hope even though it tarries it will come to pass because there is hope kanisa wakatoroka zilikuwa tukabaki na wale tulibaki na wao 
nikawaambia tutajivanua hata kama wametoka sisi tunanunua tukangangana tukanunua plot sasa tuko na plot tatu kama umesikia pasta akiongea hapa kuhusu kutoa na kuambia mfanye vitu hawabiangi kwa maana ako nazo ama anategemea mtu anakuanga na tumaini ndani ya Bwana anaongeana tumaini na tegemeo ndani ya Kristo yeah, it's your hope for this church to dominate this land tunao plot tatu tukajenga kanisa i'm giving a testimony That's why this church will be bigger. That's why this church will be a magnificent church. That's why this church will take position in this land. And somebody say, yes, there is your hope. Kamaliza kujia kanisa. Sema kwa ba nao mungu. Nataka kitu ingine. Nimeona hiyo history. Milo manipeleka taka kitu ingine. And God gave me a house. Now, see his opinion in Meongea. Mesema, a house. Tai kuambia ni ya pesa ngapi? Kini mesema, yuliza huyu, alikuwa anasema, anaona kama ni kuota, wakini hamisha. Walikuwa yuliza pasta, huku ni kwako. Ambia, eh, me umefanya ni, ambia, ulize ni mungu. There is hope. Now, now, let me read only one scripture to malizia hapo leo. Because my time is far much gone. Ani saa mbili. Saa mbili. Natuko tumesikiza mba maliza juu saa moja na daika ngapi. I don't know. But bana asifiwe. Praise the name of the Lord. Open together with me in the book of Job chapter 7. Job chapter 14. Tamalizia hapo leo kesho. Leo ni mepeana testimony. You know who is speaking to you. Unajua ni nani ana kuongelesha. Akona ametembea safari na mungu. Ameona kuna tegemeo na inafanya kazi. Praise the name of the Lord. Uyu mungu anaweza. In the book of Job chapter 14 from verse 7. Tukitere muka. Kwanza hii nalifuraisha. Ama. Hacha tisome hapo. Ndele. Nasema nini? There is still hope. For there is hope. For a tree. If it's cut down, that was proud again, and that is tender shoots not cease. Biblia ba ina tuambia at kuna tegemeo ata kwa muti uki katoa. Am I speaking to somebody? Na wange ala mutu ata muti uki katoa kuna tegemeo. Ukinusa maji umea tena. I have come in this church. Hata kana kwamba maisha yako imekatwa. Hata kana kwamba familia yako ilikatwa. Hata kana kwamba kazi yako ilikatwa. Hata kana kwamba huduma yako ilikatwa na ukafika mahali ukasikia kana kwamba hakuna kitu kingine kinaweza fanyika Biblia inatuambia kwamba kuna tege kuna tumaini hata muti ukikatwa umee tena praise the name of the lord na ikinusa maji peke yake itamea na mizizi yake haikauki as long as iko chini ninataka kuambia kwamba tegemeo lako ni kama mizizi tegemeo lako ni kama mizizi hata kana kwamba wamekata kila kitu hata kana kwamba wameharibu kila kitu hata kana kwamba walikuacha hata kana kwamba walikudharau hata kana kwamba walikuongea vipaya hata kana kwamba walikulaani hata kana kwamba walifunga nyumba hata kana kwamba walikufukuza hata kana kwamba walichoma nguo zako hata kana kwamba walisema you are good for nothing bibilia inasema kuna tena tumaini bado kuna tumaini as long as you are rooted in God as long as you are rooted in God as long as you are rooted in God I have a message for you 
something is happening. Something is happening. Wakati mtu umekatwa, ukiangalia, unaona hakuna kitu inaendelea. Wale wanakuangalia na macho ya mwili wanaona hakuna kitu kinafanyika kwako but as long as you are rooted in God something is happening something is happening something is happening something is happening pale chini bado inavuta maji pale kwa Mungu bado unachibuka tena unaanza kupata nguvu ya kuinuka kwa maana bado uko na tumaini kwa maana you are rooted in God i want to speak to somebody now i want to prophesy to you now as long as you are rooted in God may you sprout 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 may your family sprout may your business sprout may your work sprout may your ministry sprout in the name of Jesus as long as you are rooted in God and you have faith in God i declare by the power of the spirit may you sprout again in Jesus name my boss said long as when the spirit of god I don't remember the scripture but the bible says when the spirit of god will come upon you your desert will turn into a fertile land i will give you that scripture tomorrow morning your desert will turn into a fertile land do you know why even though it is dry according to the man's eye as long as God is still there he can do something and the desert will change into a fertile land because things will sprout out because when the spirit touches someone's life i want to speak to your life today as long as you have hope in god you will still sprout again hata kana kwamba walimaliza kila kitu ninatangaza nguvu ya kumea tena ninatangaza nguvu ya kumea tena ninatangaza nguvu ya kuinuka tena ninatangaza upako wa kuinuka tena ninatangaza neema ya kuinuka tena hadi jina la Yesu hadi mwaka wa 2021 i declare in the name of Jesus utainuka tena utainuka tena utainuka tena utainuka tena in the name of Jesus rapa shaka the Bible says even the dry bones in the Ezekiel chapter 37 in asema ya kwamba kuna tegemeo hata hiyo mifupa kupata uhai haijalishi nini imeisha kwako there is your hope for you to rise again there is your hope for you to move again there is your hope for you to enjoy again there is your hope for you to enjoy life again there is your hope for you to build up again in the name of Jesus rapa kata bashanda limaganda rabakanda ropo shaka baginda rabakata ropo shika da baba rabaganda rabashanda ropo kota baba rimashanda rabakata we are sprouting again 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 i'm sprouting again Again. the ministry was sprout again your work was sprout again in the name of Jesus lift up your voice rapo koda basanda we are going to sprout again we are going to sprout again we are going to sprout again because there is your hope we still have hope in God we still have hope in you Lord i pray in the name of Jesus and then is it the pana ninaomba pana mapana akashipuke tena akashipuke Puka tena, akasi puka tena. Musikirizaji, ukasi puka tena. O mama, ukasi puka tena. Muse, ukasi puka tena. O mama, Jehovah, akona pango mama kwako. Si puka tena, hati kama ombi. Si puka tena, hati kahubi. O puka tena, hati kahuduma. Si puka tena, hati kaunapi. Si puka tena, hati kafamilia. Si puka tena. In the name of Jesus, rapa kata. Shanda Jehovah Jehovah Shaka baba baba go Makando robo bunda raba kita Shinarima gandarabo otarabasha Holy Spirit of God 
और स्पिरिट ऑफ गॉड और स्पिरिट ऑफ गॉड शाखा बाबा बाबू और स्पिरिट ऑफ गॉड it is possible for you to become there is a possibility for you to become for you to become in the name of jesus you cannot stay there and die you cannot stay there and wait everything to be teared apart the bible says faith without action is dead and i command the spirit of god i pray the spirit of god may enable you to arise and take an action now because there is hope for you to rise and to sprout again in the name of jesus jehova is your name shakada jehova is your name mighty warrior mighty warrior great in battle jehova is your name shakararabu jehova is your name <laughs> jehova Mighty warrior, mighty warrior, great in battle, Jehovah. Someone lift up your voice and say, Jehovah.
May the Spirit of God begin to lift your spirit up. May the Spirit of God begin to lift your spirit up. May the Spirit of God begin to lift your spirit up. In the name of Jesus. If you believe together with me, say yes. Spirit of God, raise my spirit. Inua sauti yako peperusha mikono kwa hewa. Ongea na mungu mwambia Jehova inua, inua nafsi yangu tena. Inua nafsi yangu tena. Peperusha mikono ukinena. Mwambia Jehova inua sauti ya inua nafsi yangu tena. Inua moyo wangu tena. Hatika jina la Yesu. Kwa sababu the spirit of hopelessness. Haiwezi kakuacha hivi. You have to declare. You have to shed it away. Out of your life. In the name of Jesus. In the name of Jesus. In the name of Jesus. Father, I thank you. Lord, I give you praise. Asante kwa mkutano wale Bwana ambao umetuwezesha kuanzisha. Ninaomba Bwana watu hawa kila mmoja wao anapoenda nyumbani akaanze kushikia roho wako, akinua nafsi yake, akitia nguvu zaidi katika jina la Yesu. Waliokuwa wanatabiri, waanze kutabiri tena katika jina la Yesu. Waliokuwa wanaomba, waanze kuomba tena katika jina la Yesu. Waliosoma neno wakaanza kusoma tena katika jina la Yesu waliokuwa na biashara kubwa zianza kuinuka tena katika jina la Yesu wenye huduma tofauti tofauti zilizondolewa zilizokosa tumaini zianze kuinuka tena katika jina la Yesu wenye moyo yao imeshukishwa ninatangaza ikainuke tena katika jina la Yesu mahali furaha iliipiwa ninatangaza ikareje katika jina la Yesu kwa maana the ICO hope ya kwamba hata yale yote yaliondolewa inaweza rejeshwa kwetu tunaamini leo and this week and this month it is our day and this year is our year for us to raise again for us to sprout again for us to shine again for us to enjoy again in the name of Jesus Lord, I give you praise because it is done. I worship and I bless you. Give us tomorrow, Lord, that it may be possible to speak your word. Receive all the glory. Receive all the praise. Let the man of this house and whoever Lord serves together with him. In the name of the Father, Son, and the Holy Spirit.